I thought it was about time I gave my online avatar a bit of a makeover. I was thinking something a little taller and, dare I say, a bit more curvy. Plus, I thought her current fashion was a little bit too busy with that plaid pattern. I wanted something a bit simpler to replicate, but still stylish. So I booted up Sims 4 and had a go at getting my avatar looking roughly how I wanted her to look, though I planned on taking a bit of artistic license here and there. This was more to get myself a rough reference to work from. I began with the old wave pose. I kept this one more or less the same pose-wise as its predecessor, but mirrored it and kept the eyes open. I was aiming for more realistic proportions this time around. Each time I started a new pose, I kept the previous one up, just faded out, so I could make sure they all shared the same route, so the poses didn't jump around too much when I changed them. The pointing poses come in handy for tutorials if I want to point towards specific program icons or other things on the screen, and the same goes for the poses with the hand held out. And when it was time to flip it, I went in and changed the one asymmetrical bit of my character, namely the belt buckle. Everything else could be mirrored no problem, although I did decide to make the point be at a different angle when pointing to the right. Next up was the amazed pose. I like to have a full set of emotes, so I've got a pose ready for most situations. I wanted something dynamic, something with a lot of implied movement in it.
Then there was the super happy pose, which is pretty self-explanatory. The ears come in handy on my character for emoting. And again for the sad pose with the ears drooping. Hopefully I won't have too much occasion to use this one, but it's still fun planning out the different poses, trying to make them interesting and expressive. And here's another I hope not to have to use too often. Anger. Sheer seething anger. But, you know, better to have it and not need it, right? The eyes flash purple when angry. Dangerous stuff there. Mm, possibly. Now for something a bit more pleasant. Eager. Good for looking forward to things. Maybe a new video game release? And then boredom. Snore. Also does well for tired. Seconds from sleep. That could only come from pulling an all-nighter to finish off a particularly long project. And then one that came from the boredom one when I was midway through changing the pose to make it into a good default happy pose. Sarcasm. It was too good a chance to pass up so I did a quick sarcastic pose. And at last it was time to make the default happy pose. I have to admit I forgot this one when I was making my list of poses.
And with that, we're done. What's this? Cal is evolving? I can't wait to use these in my new videos. Stay tuned for next time.